published 2030 EDT, the 1st of November 2017, updated 0547 EDT, the 2nd of November 2017, on a night in Naples where Sergio Aguero rightfully will dominate the headlines. Another Manchester City goalscorer continued his impressive run of form. Raheem Sterling got his 10th goal of the campaign, but fellow rising English star John Stones got his third and star the show as he anchored City's comeback win. Napoli may have scored twice but neither goal can be laid at the feet of Stones. An error from teammate Danilo saw Lorenzo Insigne give the hosts the lead and a clumsy challenge from Leroy Sane, a virtual alien to his own penalty box, allowed Jorginho to score a penalty. Man City stars Kevin De Bruyne, Raheem Sterling and John Stones LR celebrate John Stones celebrates his header off the underside of the bar put Manchester City in front Stones performance drew praise from pundits including Exengland defender Martin Keown and between the two Napoli goals Stones had hit the bar and put City ahead. That was just the 23-year-old contribution in attack. At the other end he was just a picture of composure, controlling Napoli danger and dries Mertens and starting City's forward moves with typically incisive passing. It was a performance that drew rich praise from the pundits, including former England centre-half Martin Keown. John Stones is growing in stature and, in both penalty boxes now, HES made a massive improvement at what he does, said the Sports Mail columnist. It was a really dominant display from him, HES getting better every game. The Stones vs. Tries Mertens battle was notable during the first half at the Stadio San Paolo Keown added Gareth Southgate now HES got to pick Stones. If you get into the Man City team you get into the England team it's almost a given. Exeter captain Richard Dunn was equally effusive in his praise of Stones hailing his increasing maturity. Last year he was judged as £40-£50 million defender instead of a 23-year-old centre-half, who won't mature for a couple more years. But HES getting there, said Dunn. Jermaine Genus was another impressed by Stone's improvement and mental strength, he said with Stone's the spotlight is always on him. The media have a love-hate relationship with the way that he plays, HES been criticised for the risks he takes, a lot. What we're seeing is the fruits of those risks, because HES maintained his confidence. If the coach would have knocked that confidence out of him, had just be going long.